What's going on, Shady people? Shady Penguin here. Welcome back to the next episode of our Pokemon X Shady Lock Challenge. Today, it's raining outside, and uh, we gotta go check out some fossils. I wanna make our team look pretty strong. You guys let me know that I do have a free heal, another floating free heal, which I think leaves us at three floating free heals, which is pretty nice, pretty nice for sure. I think this is the fossil shop. I don't know if it's called the fossil shop. I'm calling it a fossil shop. Where is Serena? Hello? Hello? Is anyone there? Hello? Where are you? Here we are. Cutscene. There she is. Wait for me. Oh, look who it is. Wow, welcome future archaeologists. You were drawn here by the mystique of fossils, no doubt. My name is Serena, and this is Shady. We're researching Megavolution, and we were wondering if you know anything about it. Oh, <laughs> oh you're a Professor Sycamore student. I've heard about you. Megavolution, you say? I'm sorry. Ah, uh, but all I know is that it has something to do with mysterious stones. Still, since you're students of the Professor, you must know about Pokemon fossils, correct? Wonderful! I expect no less from Professor Sycamore's students. That's right. Fossils are the legacy of prehistoric Pokemon. You should really go to the dig site and see the real thing firsthand. Oh, I see. Well, if you don't know anything about Mega Evolution, then... Well, hold on. Pokemon that can be restored from fossils just might have something to do with Mega Evolution. The assistant in Glittering Cave right now might know about that. What should I do? Well, since I'm already here, maybe I should go talk to that assistant. Are you going to Glittering Cave, Leo? Yes, I am! Gosh darn it, I want an encounter! You can't stop me! You cannot! We get two encounters. I think we get the encounter on the Rhyhorn, and we get the encounter inside the cave. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong. Could be wrong. Also, our room is no longer red. Spikes! Passage. Because I really, I was streaming the other day, and I made our room look like this. I really like the way it looks. So we're gonna go ahead and rock out with... I don't want to meet other players! A, ni e a nice Easter themed uh, room. Cause it's like blue and purple, it's pretty Eastery. It's pretty Eastery. As long as that purple's in the bottom of the room looks pretty good. I like purple and red as well. Our encounter for Spike's Passage is... I feel like you belong here. This is a fossil area, you're a fossil Pokemon. Something smells here and it ain't my toes. Okay, Lily. Let's go ahead and let's go out into Stu Pickles. Cause we can try to paralyze you. We can try to paralyze you. Get you donezo funzo. Get you locked up and shocked up like right. You know. <laughs> Referencing a classic here. My goodness. So I woke up today and I'm pretty angry at the universe because my throat is hurting again. And you guys know I just got done being sick for a very long time. So I'm very sad about the fact that I'm sick again, or that I'm getting sick, and I'm... I have big plans today to record four videos. <clears throat> Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. But, um, it might not happen if I'm getting sick right around Easter time. All right, we just, we just need to go ahead and paralyze you. Then we can go ahead and go for a stronger move, like Peck, or even Headbutt would be stronger. Peck would be neutral. Peck would be what we go for, paralyze, paralyze. I just want to catch you easily. I know you're just a lily. You'll probably get caught on one or two balls, even if you're not paralyzed. But I would really appreciate the paralysis. I would. Let's see. Still nothing. Cool. Sweet. Awesome. So I think what I think there's a chance that I caught something in Germany. Or you know what? My my wife is coughing a little bit. My daughter still got the sniffs. I could have just got what they got and what they're dealing with. So it's totally possible. I really hope not. I hope maybe it's just my throat is for some reason in pain. And that's really it. If not, though, I did learn. Now I'm too afraid to go for Peck. You're too low. Uh, if not, then I learned that I can just call my doctor and say, Hey, give me some of that fantastic Z-Pack if I'm sick for more than a week. So we'll count today. Today's starting. Today's Thursday. So next Thursday, I may be ordering more Z-Pack. Uh, who knows? Knows, knows. Great ball, go. Great ball, go. I'm pulling up comments because I already know we're catching this fool. That's one jiggle. That's two jiggles. That's all three jiggles. Just kidding, we didn't catch it. I got you guys, didn't I? You might not have been watching and I got you. I got him! Might have got him real good. Okay, um... I'm gonna try to go for a headbutt. Headbutt should definitely be stronger. Uh, we could flinch, I guess. 
Awesome. Nice and in the red and the flinch. Don't go to the yellow. Okay, still in the red. Now I'm, I have all the confidence in the world. Every single imaginary object of confidence, I got it. It's mine. Don't worry about it. That's one. That's two. And that's three. Oh, yeah. There we go. Lilip was caught. Nice and captured. Stupid Ghost gains 172. Saucy gains 172. Lilip's data was added to the Pokedex. Hmm. Hmm. Here we go. It disguises its tentacles as flowers to attract and catch prey. It became extinct in ancient times. Ancient Lily. What are we going to name you? Aw, Ben, I will go ahead and nickname a Pokemon Tuggles. This is a... This is a good Tuggles, a female Lily. I hope your recovery from your surgery goes well. Uh, glad you're enjoying the content. Hopefully I can keep you company during this uh, recovery time that you're going through. So, we got Tuggles, the, 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 the not Cradilly, the Lily, sent to the box, nice and captured. We can no longer catch Pokemon on this route. Uh, Rhyhorn, you move way slower than I remember. Rhydon, no, Rhyhorn. I think I, I think I confused them the other day. I said, that, oh yeah, ride on. I'm gonna ride on a ride on, but it's just actually a Rhyhorn. Ride on is the uh, big boy. Good. Thankfully, you went on that side, not the other side. I would have cried. Not actually cry, but I would have been pretty tilted. I would have been, I would have been pretty tilted. So we're gonna get this encounter we just got. We got a Lily. We're gonna get inside a glittering cave, and then we're actually gonna get a fossil Pokemon as well. I think. I think we do get a fossil in there. Uh, so we're progressing. You do so much in X and Y before the second gym. It's kind of mind blowing how much content there's already been. And it's, oh, Rotom. It's felt like content content. It hasn't felt like tutorial, like another game I know of. It's literally felt like content and I'm excited about it. Got away safely. Maybe Saucy shouldn't be out front right now. Nah, we'll keep Saucy out front. What's the worst that can happen? Pursuit trap, LOL. Oh, another item. Let's go get it. You guys also give me pro tips about if I'm short on money, just go to a restaurant, use that amulet coin and you will get paid like no tomorrow. So if we're very strapped for cash, I will most definitely do that. Most definitely do that. Here we go. Oh, let's back it up, back it up, back it up. Here we go. No, no, just walk. Yeah, no, no, just, just walk, just walk. There we go, it's not tough, tough, dude. Let's break this rock because it's in our way. Let's go all the way to the left so we can Spare, maybe we'll spare one of these frocks. Maybe even two. I'm not sure. I'm hoping to. Tend to cruel. Mmm. I would horn leech you here. You're probably, I'm probably not gonna be able to run away. I'm gonna horn leech you. I'm gonna really hope that you don't have uh, liquid ooze. That would be very unfortunate. Let's see. No liquid ooze. Nice. Okay, so we'll take you out. You're a fully evolved Pokemon. Uh, you're just going for constrict like a forehead. And I think this is a good time. I think this is a super duper solid time. Acid, that's neutral. Wow, look at that damage. Look at that damage. Here we go. Boom, Wild Tentacruel fainted, very nice. Saucy gains 411. I almost said 411,000, I'm not sure why. I'm not exactly sure why I did, but I almost did. Okay, here we go. Let's shabram. Very nice. Shabram. We'll break that one because it's in the way. And this trainer is going to want to fight me. I don't know what's over there, but we're going to we're gonna go over there before we go inside of the cavern. Oh, look. It's another little leap. Oh, toggles. Toggles. We got away safely. Nice. I did see a nickname suggestion that I do really want to use. Um, so hopefully the next one we catch it, it fits it. Because I think it's a, I think it's a great nickname. I think it's a fantastic. I'm not gonna tell you until we catch Pokemon. You're never gonna know. Ampharos! What a great po I, I stepped on an Ampharos. I feel terrible. I should be completely electrified by now. Well, actually, Rhyhorn absorbed all the electricity because it's just immune to it. So it just doesn't even, it doesn't even transfer. That's pretty dope. Is this where there's a sky battle over here? I feel like this is sky battle area. Look, X and Y introduced so many different things. Sky battles, mega evolution. Come on, man. Who's hate? Who is hating on this game? Who be hating? Rhyhorn looks dark. How do I get that item? Care for a sky battle with a trainer? With my rubber flying suit, I can completely shrug off electric type moves. All right, she's ready. Um, 
And she has a Zapdos! What? Well, I'm gonna body the Zapdos real quick. Uh, maybe I won't. It's like the That's like the worst Pokemon I could have seen! I'm just gonna double Dragon Rage. Yo, this Sky Battle is epic right now. Charizard versus Zapdos, T-Wave, okay, okay, okay. Charizard, I feel like this Zapdos will not have Thunderbolt, so I feel like you just have to live with Thunder Shock. Detect, okay, wasting my PP, awesome, sweet, my PP's wasted. Uh, it's actually, it's actually really bad, you only have two left. Thunder Shock, okay, please just survive that. You can tank it, you can take it, nice. There we go! Bro, I don't know if I've ever done a Sky Battle before. I mean, I must have done it once, but I really don't remember them. Wow. A zap, what an epic sky battle. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Wait, it doesn't matter if I'm wearing the suit, it's my Pokemon team. Your Pokemon was dishing out the hits. You weren't even weak to electricity. Stop it. Stop your naysaying. My goodness. It would've been so funny if I didn't have Charizard and I clicked yes to that sky battle and then I just went in with my level three combi. That would've been pretty awesome. That would've been pretty darn awesome. Let's paralyze heal, and let's go ahead and heal up Zuko. We're gonna be, we're gonna be using a heal soon. We're gonna be using a heal. We have a bunch of floating free heals. So I'll probably just call out one of those and go to the Pokemon Center after this section of the game. Because I think getting this far without using a heal is pretty impressive. A part of me just wanted to see exactly how far I could get without using a heal just for like my own challenge. Hail Trina, allow, oh, oh, oh. I guess we're using the free heal from her. Never mind. Hail Trainer, you must have some impressive Pokemon to have made it this far. It's like she knew that I wasn't healing. Wow. It's real easy to get lost inside this here cave. Just take one step at a time. Go rushing in all careless and you'll never find your way out. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. All right, so that obviously wasn't a token. That was a free heal from her. Oh, our encounter in Glittering Cave is going to be a giant. Massive. Clink Clang. Okay, Clink Clang. I have used Clink Clang. Well, I think, did I ever make it up to Clink Clang? I'm not sure if I made it up to Clink Clang. But I've used this Pokemon from time to time. Vice Grip, we are immune, you fool. We are immune. Okay. Uh, let's see how much a Horn Leech does. Should not do much at all, honestly. Charge, you're storing up electricity inside of those steel body parts of yours. Wow. That's really good damage. Charizard, you have one Dragon Rage left, don't you? Yeah, you do. Good. We also got into our uh, Night Shading Pringle Man Julius. But we're gonna go ahead and go, oh, gear grind. Uh, shouldn't do much damage. Shouldn't do much to Zuko. He's kind of a champion around these parts. Uh, I'm pretty sure you're gonna have more than 40 HP. Let's go for a Dragon Rage. Ooh! I am so glad you snapped out of confusion. My goodness. That would have been another dead encounter had, I, had it not. All right, boys. We got no paralysis on here because I totally slipped my mind. Let's go ahead and go for the greatest of balls. One, it do. Oh, so close, so very close. Okay, you're gonna charge it up. Cool, awesome, cool, sweet, splendid, fantastic. Uh, let's go for another ball. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, you're still not cut, and you have Thunder Shock. Uh, this might act, oh, come on. I just got healed, bro. I just got healed. And I had more than one Dragon Rage, obviously. This got healed. Oh my goodness, dude. Um, this is tough. I did not, I did not expect this. All right, we're gonna swap out. Um, gonna do Pickles. Stu Pickles has the best defense of all time. Really wish I would have won for the paralysis. I was using my brain space so well up until not paralyzing this guy. Uh, all right, we only have like six more balls to attempt this. Let's see, five more balls to attempt this. I like Kling Clang, all right? I would not mind having it in the box. So please, Kling Clang, 
I know you're fully evolved. But this is this is absurd. You have no HP left. Just 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 get inside the ball. You're gonna die if you're left out here. If I click run, you're gone. One. And like, what happens to a Pokemon that faints in the wild? Like, where does it go? What does it do? I'm scared for you. You're gonna, if you don't get in this ball, your, your fate is going to be very unbecoming. I beg you, join my team. I will bring you all the nuts and bolts you can desire. All the oil you can drink will be yours. Please. I don't think it's gonna happen. Not gonna lie, I don't think it's gonna happen. I have a very strong feeling that uh, this is going to be two balls down the drain and we'll have nothing to show for it. One, two, reverse psychology. No, oh, I shouldn't have told him. Oh, I shouldn't have told him that I was doing reverse psychology. I wait, I got too, I got too cocky. I got too confident that we were going to catch it. I got way too confident we were going to catch it. Okay, here we go. Last ball, clink clang. Last, you're not even a legendary, all right? One. Two, three. This cheeky piece of metal! <sighs> All right. You've sealed your fate, my friend. You've sealed it. Like a letter to a loved one on a Thursday. That's what you've done. I'm gonna make sure you never see the light of day. All right. Everyone's gaining a 5 out of 68 because there's no split experience. It's just shared. I know I've said in the past that it was, oh no, you're going to split, but no, it's shared experience. I do know this. I do understand this. Uh, we're going to keep Saucy out front to keep gaining some nice momentum in the level growth. Giant boy! Is it another Kling Clang? I'm running if it is. What else could we have gotten? Oh, didn't want that! Nope! Not a fan of Tyranitar. Not even a little bit. Actually think it's one of the worst Pokemon of all time. Uh, really don't like it. I'm gonna go ahead and knock him out because of how little I like him. Ooh, weird pain in my back. I'm gonna go knock him out because of how little I like him. Okay, do it KO. Trevenant is a monster. Trevenant has taken out so many Tyranitars in his day. Dossy. Chip away. Doesn't affect me, you, you. This is why you need a trainer. This is why you should have joined me straight up. This is why you should have joined me straight up. Tyranitar faints. Oh no. 655 experience. That is almost a full level. Almost. Keep going. I don't really know where I'm going at this point. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. So many big shadows. You got a Raichu. Okay. I think this will be worth uh, knock me out as well. It's another fully evolved Pokemon. Another fully evolved Pokemon that really needs trainer because it's going for quick attacks against a ghost type. Really wish you would uh, let someone train you, man. I think Astana should be enough to take it out. I know it's not an Alolan Raichu, but uh, based on how much Horn Leech did, yeah. There we go. Awesome. No! First case scenario, bro. That's all she wrote for our saucy. All she wrote. We're gonna take that experience and you're gonna get swapped to the back. We need, I might need to grind out some restaurants. I feel like we don't have that much money right now. Bring man, get out here. Okay. Uh, I don't wanna face another Pokemon unnecessarily. I just wanna get to the end of the cave. Oh, we found power up punch. Wow. That's a great TM. Let's see who can learn it. I miss the power up punch days. Ooh, Trevenant can learn it. And Charizard. And... Um, I'm gonna teach it to Trevenant, I think. Because... Dark types, bro. Let's get rid of Astonish. Now let's get rid of Growth. We don't need Growth now, we got Power up Punch. It's not like we have Charizard Y on our team. With Charizard Y, we can set the sun, we can double growth, but we're not we're not trying to double grow. Okay, so that was worth coming over here. I feel like that means that the exit. Uh that's the right way. Oh, I think I found it. 
Nice, dude. Nice and found. Oh, snap. Our first introduction to flare wear. What's this? Well, well, what do we have here? A nosy little trainer has come poking around. Listen up! With a fashionable team whose na very name makes people tremble in fear. Team Flair! Team Flair's goal is to make it so we're the only ones who are happy. We don't care one bit about what happens to other trainers or Pokemon. Get out of here, kid. Don't you know not to play with fire? No! Getting my fancy suit dirty isn't the stylish way to do things, but if you insist, I'll obliterate you! Get him, Houndour! Houndour! Hounder! Houndor! Houndour! Team Flare Grunt is gonna send out a Watch Hog. That is almost a Houndour. You're tough, dude. I'm gargling salt water immediately after this recording session. All right, Pringle Man, you need to gain some levels because it looks like we are, um, we're getting pretty close to being on par here. Level 18 and on level 22, that does not feel that great. Stop, your Watch Hog's eyes look so good. At Stop! It looks so good in this game. Oh, poor Julius. Poor Julius. But I don't think you're gonna be able to touch me. Like, look. Detect. Detect, hypnosis, uh, leer, and then probably a normal type move. Let's see. Okay, we're dodging hypnosis. We're landing water pulses. Three KO? Uh, maybe. Looks like a four KO to me, unfortunately. Detect! Ah, oh, we're just gonna we're just gonna waste all of our PP on this watch dog. With those crazy eyes. Sand attack, not leer. Sand attack, attack, hypnosis, normal type move. Pretty easy stuff. Confusion? No confusion. Okay, here we go. Water pulse. Come through. Stop with your detecting. Oh my gosh. It's not fun. It's not fun. Hypnosis. We're dodging. Water pulse. We're connecting. Confusion? Or we're we just going to take you out? There we go. There we go. Pokemon Mangy is 567. Send him Breloom. Breloom. Um, let's just play a safe one to Stew Pickles. We can peck him. We can pe Peter pick up Pipers and peck him all over the place. I can't believe how damaged my team is. But at least we're going to get extra money for this thanks to the amulet coin. Right? I think that uh, Pringle Man is holding the amulet coin. So I'm pretty sure we're going to be fine. On money for this episode, we gotta buy more balls, obviously, and then we gotta buy uh, some healing items because we're paralyzed, running out of potions, all that good stuff. Uh, and at least now that we're kind of on par again with levels, or we're close to, we're not super over leveled, we can go ahead and face trainers and get their money. We can steal their launch money, it's fine. What's this? You're a pretty tough Pokemon trainer for a kid, but watch yourself. I'm not the only member of Team Flare. Okay, thanks for the warning. Appreciate it. We got more Flare members. We're gonna take everyone else down so we can do what we want. What we want. I'm so sorry for doing that. My goodness. I think I'm gonna edit that out. I, I, there's a chance. I, I'm really lightheaded. I was trying to do the re, but I said we. I'm not editing it out. It'll just be an embarrassing moment that's forever immortalized on my channel. Fun, that's how you lose viewers. That's how you turn shady people into goodbye. That's how you do it. You say goodbye. You just say goodbye. Stu Pickle's gonna use Supersonic. Oh, would you look at that? Let's peck away. We're dodging. Stu Pickles is a beast, dude. Stu Pickles is, oh, why am I going for this? Because it's my strongest move. Is it? Is it stronger than Headbutt? Yes, it is. Maybe. Maybe it's the same. I don't know what Headbutt's base power is. Is it 80 or 85? Or 70? I couldn't tell you. It's forever a mystery. There's no tools on the internet that will tell you what it is. So we'll just have to die, go to our graves without knowing what Headbutt's base power is. Don't leave it in the comments, please. Don't do it. Uh, Pringle Man grows to level 23. Only 17 more levels till we have a nice fully evolved Pokemon. Um, It's unfortunate. I'm gonna stay in. I'm gonna stay in and I am going to twin needle the hashtag out of this Cresselia. Safeguard all you want. Sure, it stinks that I can't do anything crazy to you, but Stu Pickle snap and get a confusion almost immediately. And I think it's gonna be a 2 KO. Oh. Oh. Fantastico. Fantastico. Okay. Here it is. 
moonlighting. Is that what we're doing here? We're just gonna, we're gonna moonlight. Is this gonna be a slow and steady grind? Is that what we're doing? You're gonna make me use more PP? Unbelievable. These Pokemon with all of their PP causing obstructions. It's ridiculous. We eventually win this. But I think this is my, I think this is my best bet anyway. I think I'm doing more damage than Dragon Rage would. Ow. And then... Ow. If I crit him, that would be great. I think we might win. Not on the next one. If it's not... Not the next one. Definitely the one after. Oh! Goes for confusion. Thank goodness. You're done moonlighting. Awesome. Get it out of here. Twin Needle. You're gone, Cresselia. Get wrecked. You didn't have the perseverance, the patience to play Toxic Stall. Plus, I had the direct counter. You can't even Toxic Stall that. You can't even set up a sub! Unreal. Get shredded. Get shredded. I think you could set up a sub, actually. The biggest wants to learn False Swipe. No, I will not learn False Swipe. Not today. Not today. Feed it last. Ugh. Yes, I was able to defeat you. Ha ha. Ha ha. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Oh, double battle. I'm not ready for this. We're Team Flare. We put the fashion into fear. We're looking for fossils because good. Oh, sh Shady. There are two members of Team Flare. Well then, are you ready to team up and battle them? I just fought with another one of these Team Flare guys. If you just want to make people in Team Flare happy, why don't you do just that? But if you're going to go around threatening other people, we won't let you get away with it. Oh, honey. All right, here we go. Revy two? This is not fair. How is this fair? Unbelievable. Hmm. Mega Beedrill? No, it's regular Beedrill. Feels bad. Okay. Um. I'm gonna go ahead and bubble beam both of these. Really counter your Beedrill. We're gonna go for the Gigalith. Pyro goes for takedown. Beedrill nimbly dodges and goes for a Fury attack onto the Pyro. Okay, that's gonna do. Pretty much no damage. Good choice, good choice, good choice. I like it, I like it, I like it. Riggle Man goes for the Bubble Beam. And that's a 2 KO. Spice. Rock Blast very clearly on the Beedrill. Goodbye, Beedrill. It's been real, it's been fun. Can't say it's been real fun. Hey, Serena, why don't you send out a good Pokemon? What was that, Oshawott? Yeah, that's better. That's a lot better, I think that. All right, I'm gonna bubble beam the Gigalith again. Noble Roar. That does not do anything to me. Oshawott's attack falls, special attack falls. Bubble beam is gonna take out the Gigalith before it can move. Not that explosion would have been a big deal for me, but no chance to explode now, Gigalith. Keep your rocks to yourself. Keep your rocks to yourself. Rigaman gains almost a thousand experience from that spice. Water Sport is gonna weaken this Pyroar, crippling it. Making it crawl on its tail. Beautiful. Go for another bubble beam. Oh wait, I'm going for a bubble beam when I have water pulse. Am I a forehead? Then again, PP. I'm just gonna claim that it was uh, intentional so that I could uh, preserve PP. Here we go, that's the claim. Nice. Awesome, let's lie to everyone. My 3DS is gonna die soon. Uh, water pulse, not enough. But with razor shell, it will be. Is that a crit? No crit. I'm gonna say maybe you need that crit with your special attack drop, but you didn't, you just didn't. Pringle Man grows to level 24. Pringle Pringle Man grows to level 24. Go, go, Team Flare. Oh, I guess I'll stop cheering now. I like that girl all the way to the right. She's cool. Is she a dragon tamer? I like her skirt. It's like art chain mail. Oh, man. My favorite fashionable Team Flare suit is filthy. If we can restore fossils, we can make some good money. All right, Serena. What are you doing? I'm a trainer. Protecting my partners is what I do. Come on, let's go look for that researcher from the Pokemon Fossil Lab. Let's do it. Should be right around the corner since we just had an epic double battle. We found ourselves in a Scapio Rope. Because I don't want to go through. I found the team in that cave. I'm not going through it again. No way. No way. Did you find him? Ah, hello. I'm here to look at the fossils as well. Are you okay? Did Team Flare come here? Team Flare? What's that, a Pokemon? Don't worry about it. it. Looks like he was completely absorbed in looking for fossils. You two are very lucky. I just found two fossils, but they're both ones I already have, so I'll give one to each of you. Do you want the Daw fossil or the Sail fossil? We're gonna go with the Sail fossil. Uh, I'm sure that it's not, I'm sure, well, am I sure it'll be randomized? I'm not positive it'll be randomized, but I'm hoping it's randomized. Uh, we'll find out. 
We will find out. Can you put the sail fossil away? Well, then I'll take this one. I'll restore your fossils and turn them back to the Pokemon at the fossil lab. I hope to see you there. Well, that's all she wrote about our fossil adventures. That's one for the history books. Ah. Well, we went looking for an assistant and we found that suspicious group called Team Flare as well. I guess I should train more so I can travel safely with those Team Flare people running around. In that case, I guess the best thing to do would be to challenge the Silage City Gym. Okay, well, uh, we're going to go ahead and we are going to use our Scopy Rope. What, whatever bag or pocket it may be in, which is right here. Ha <laughs> ha! I don't think this takes us back to town. I think it takes us right outside of the cave. Uh, we got our two encounters for today. Unfortunately, one of them was not caught. My battery's about to run out, so we're going to pick it up right here in the next one. We'll find out what fossil we get in the next episode, which I believe will be tomorrow. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to show some shady love. Set thumbs up down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. Have yourselves a fantastic day. But above all else, keep it shady.